Hey guys, what's up? Nexikika here. We are doing one of these reaction video thingies. I haven't done one in what? Sorry, my alarm went off at the start of the video. Hey guys, Nexikika here. We're actually doing something we haven't done in forever and a half. A reaction video thingy. Because when was the last time I did a reaction video? Like, last E3? Maybe? I don't remember. It's been a fucking ages. I haven't made content forever anyways, honestly, so <laughs> let's get into it. Ooh, writing pending, which could mean boobies. Yeah, yeah, used in-game, or not, or not, potentially. Ooh, PlayStation, so that's a really nice logo. Oh, what the fuck is this? What the, what the fuck is this? Alright. Is that Star Wars? I hate this music, what is this? It looks like Starfield, maybe. I don't know. There could be a few different possibilities for me, but it's a good thing. Whatever it is I'm in, maybe. That looks pretty okay. Not the worst I've seen. That's either. Is that Metal Gear? No. Oh, it's Warhammer. It's a uh, Warhammer. Hi everyone. I'm Herman Hulst, head of PlayStation Studios. Who are and you? I'm honored to present the first state of play of 2024. The first three years of PS5 have given us incredible stories, immersive worlds, and groundbreaking mm -hmm. gameplay from PlayStation Studios and their partners. Okay. We've also expanded PlayStation Plus with new features, including PS5 game streaming. And with PSVR 2 and PlayStation Portal, yeah, which released last November, great. we're committed to offering new and surprising ways for audience to interact with their PS5. But none of this means anything without great games, like Helldivers 2, which mm -hmm. kicks off a year of amazing experiences and diverse ways to play. Today, matter. we're looking ahead to titles good. coming or later this year okay, and beyond, say, yeah, with extended great. gameplay and announcements I mean, we hope you find as nice. exciting as we do here uh, at PlayStation. It looks okay, but Enjoy I don't think a good way to start your presentation. Nobody's looking for, sh for party shooters anymore. Stop worrying when Alright, badass, 10 out of 10, game of the year. Badass. She looks pretty, like conventionally pretty. But, like, what's more to her than this? Shift up. I thought it said shit up. What does the fucking shit up mean? Welcome to the world. See, there's of no Blade. selling point other than ass, which means it's a Mihoyo game. The story begins on post apocalyptic. Is this in the near universe? Where a mysterious enemy called the Natiba no. has forced the human race to flee to an off world. Oh, colony. look, it really is just another near game about Toyota. Players will take control maybe. of Eve, a member of the 7th Airborne Squad. It... Her mission is to save the planet by defeating the Everybody hyped Natiba. this up on my Facebook because it's. It's sexy girls, guys. You must do this is how you sell your game with sexy While girls. Most of the seventh airborne squad is lost like during their descent from like the colony. Eve soon meets two new companions. You have to have a more than game than a sexy girl. Like is in pursuit of an energy it's why MGS5 five Make sure bomb. to stay cautious. Yeah, it's so well. But so this nobody talks about MGS5 the way we talk about two, one, two, or three. Lily, a member of the 5th Airborne Squad, provides engineering because support. Because nobody Artemis the second. talks about it. Then why can be your engineering they talk about quiet. Support. They don't talk about She puts her, her technical knowledge to use story by to upgrading her ass. equipment throughout the game. But for a white woman, she had an okay ass. Here. Yeah. Done. Something does feel different. It, the game looks okay. It looks like another Nier game. This is Zion. It looks interesting. A city built underneath the wasteland by the last human survivors but it on Earth. Doesn't look a city underneath like the wasteland. Eve is called Angel, Angel by the survivors and is an object of both awe and fear. I'm not selling anything to you. 
They'll seem a bit wary at first, but will gradually loosen up as Eve shows a commitment to rebuilding the city. So Angel is either feared or respected probably for her actions in the war, I'm guessing? I can't believe the Angel is here. The survivors it looks like a generic Blade Runner knockoff game on it sometimes. Please save my younger sister! Wait, quite here. I'm wondering whether that was a point or not. Their requests will often lead her to the wasteland and the great desert. It looks it looks okay. It doesn't look terrible. This place has been overrun but by Nati. I think Nihoyo Nihoyo malfunctioning machines of and mirror, robots. And like thought that Tubi's ass was a selling point and not the story. So I can. Which I play I just played like Tor Toro You'll because he's ass versus the corn links. Bless spots. you, buddy. Dog sneeze is kinda cute. At each camp, Eve can purchase various consumable it items. It looks okay. Acquire new skills. It doesn't look like game of the year. It doesn't look bad. Upgrade equipment and more. She can also take a well-deserved break to restore her health. Angel. Eve will often encounter people in need and other non-human beings who may need her help. Request your assistance. Whether to assist or ignore them is entirely up to the player. On her journey to defeat the Elder Natiba, Eve will sometimes encounter hostile survivors. Or... Ooh, kitty! I'm waiting for something interesting. I just... I'm just looking at it. Oh, she looks pretty, something I guess. Worse. But like it, this, now that it's it, packed up, it pick, pick up a bit what more. What are you going to it do looks, after you defeat the Alpha Nitiba? A bit better. It looks, it looks okay. Exist for the one gameplay looks purpose. nice. Cutscenes are cool looking. The extinction of all Nitibas, right? To think that I the think point the of your existence is to snuff out another right now species. Is that have you picked up after Nier? That is not an easy fight. Out, 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 it's out, fine. I can do this alone. It won't be easy. That's the unofficial Anomalia. name for members of the Eve Airborne Squad. Is uh, that you kind of have to pick up a bit? I can feel the hatred, but I and how do you kind of yeah, have a shadow? Source. I will find it, and I will make I'm it pay. I'm thinking this game's gonna try that something different, other than machine, other than the obvious physical differences. Story-wise, we're not given a full lot. We're introduced to Eve and from the world around her, but we don't know what caused the cataclysm and what caused these monsters to attack us. You know, this is no longer the drone you knew. And I'm kind of interested to see what's going to go from there. So close Probably won't be a day with the for me, but it's not bad. But like, there's so much set piece design, I can't really react to it. Like, I can't go, oh, that's, that's, that's interesting. I'm not gonna go, oh, to like big set pieces anymore, you know? Unless it looks kind of really interesting. And doesn't go on for too fucking long. It's not bad, though. It's a, probably a, maybe a B tier game, and I'll probably pick it up at some point. 안녕하세요. Shiptop의 대표이자 게임의 디렉터인 김영태입니다. 이 게임은 우리가 수년간 유저 여러분들께 선보이기 위해 꿈꿔왔던 게임이며 플레이스테이션 5 그리고 플레이스테이션 스튜디오의 전폭적인 지원 덕분에 그 꿈을 현실화할 수 있게 되었습니다. 기나긴 여정이었고 빨리 팬분들이 4월 26일 스텔라 블레이드를 만나 보시기를 기대합니다. Oh hell yeah! I'm a generations, baby! This looks really pretty, Jesus. It's very colorful and bright. It's what Sonic should be. Everyone who's doing a dark Sonic, he should still be colorful and bright, you know? Like, Sonic Prime, you know, that was pretty cool. 
What the fuck? Ain't no way! Was that fucking Shadow? Hell yeah! Heroes rise again, baby! Wait... Is this fucking Shadow the Hedgehog footage? It fucking suggests- It fucking hell did I have? Fucking Shadow the Hedgehog is back, baby! Our Edge King is back! And his black monster present. You know what? We'll talk about Shadow the Hedgehog when back. This is so fucking dumb, I love it! <laughs> I just said earlier I wasn't gonna react like a fucking child to cool set pieces, but it's so fucking dumb and shout out the hedgehog. Like that game was so fucking dumb, I loved it. Oh. Alright. Oh! Like this uh what the fuck is this? I was gonna say this is a thing. Okay, cool. That's cool. But what is this? Some stars. This definitely is a Miho Young game. This is anime. It looks kinda it looks kinda neat. Yeah. It looks like it's gonna be like a um, another action RPG or some interesting design concept in, in Duba. I mean clearly that's what I'm saying because it's showing right now, but like it being Miho Yo, it's kinda hard to say for sure for the details. Oh, the sound I make when I sleep? It's called it's, it's Z Z Z. She's like, she's sleepy! She's Z Z Z! Uh Oh, this is oh phone party. I was just joking at phone party, shit. I you can book it down here. This J-pop intro is kinda cool. See, they said this isn't, isn't like Splatoon, but all they showed is that it's just Splatoon with fucking Mr. Satan here. Which, Mr. Satan being in Splatoon would be kind of neat. What's that fucking joke of uh, uh, Deadly Dorm preferences? It's foam, right? That's, that's what fucking is. It's, it's, it's just foam, the game. Wait, why did they say fucking Helldivers can be the start off with the diversity of games when it fucking Foam Stars has everybody under the sun? But fucking Bianca Belair. Yo, is that Atlas Coon? The average weeaboo gamer. Yo, is that a fucking. Oh. What is this game? I know nothing about it other than controversy. Is this, it looks kind of okay. It looks interesting. Like, it looks like a game I would play, like, for fun. Uh, Godzilla? That's Godzilla. I know the song anyway. Wait. Is that a fucking space Godzilla? They fucking put space Godzilla in this. Hell yeah! You mean getting out of the club as Godzilla destroys my family? What is this? Okay, vampires. But what is it? It looks like Diablo, or like one of those dungeon colors, like Fate. I think it might be a dungeon color, but it looks, it looks unique enough. But what is it though? Like what's it called? It looks interesting. Like, I what does I say? This is to make a game I might pick up at some point. Yo, we're fucking dark, dark riders now. Dark riders now. Hell yeah. It looks interesting. V has come to V. V. Okay, V Rising. Okay. V Rising might be a pickup for me. Only because I like vampires. 
It looks interesting enough. I wonder Hi everyone, next with I'm this Sean game. Benson. This next game is a result of a very close partnership with Konami, Konami and marks the return Konami. of a horror for franchise money. that has been with us since the original PlayStation. Let's take a look at what's next for Silent Hill. V money, let's go. Wait, Konami shit. I spoke too much on fucking things up up shit. Okay. I know that violin anywhere. Maybe I can Maybe. be like her. Like who? This looks like white Is this Silent Hill? Here goes. Is this that new Silent Hill game? I, I they sort of make. Because it looks, it looks more like White Day, which I think is dream? interesting, because White Day was an interesting horror game. Who's there? Yo, White... What's with this place? Okay. Cherry blossoms bloom within the grasp of death. You know what? What are you hiding inside? I'm interested in this. Maya? This looks interesting. No. What the fuck? This looks interesting. It looks like a unique concept. Not an original one, sure, but nothing's original anymore. Just make it your own. And it looks neat. What did I do to deserve this? I don't know, man. What did you do to deserve this? Okay. Oh, free to play. It might be garbage, but hey, you know what? One man's trash is another man's trash. Ha! Konnichiwa, Silent Hill series of producer of Tsumeru Okamoto Motoi desu. Go down to the Silent Hill 2. Silent Hill is a short message to you, Mattaka Tarashi Silent Hill 2. This is Silent Hill 2, isn't it? It sounds like a scene that we made in Silent Hill 2. Which, if we get in it's very creepy and like claustrophobic. I want to paint it black. I'll always got paint it black from this fucking song. And I want to paint it black. But where is the story? But where is the story? Where is Maria? But how does. Okay, I'm a little worried now. I'm not seeing story. Look, you can go into a Silent Hill game from where My LP is Silent Hill 1 should confirm that. That being said, where's where's the where's the story here? Silent Hill 2 has been more about the story than the shooting. Where is the deep like, where is the menace in this? Oh, well, here is the menace. Are we interested in Kevin Head without the brutal, the, the brutality of him? So that's interesting. And I don't like that though. I mentioned earlier nothing is unique, but it's. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. Say okay. I have. And my AD deactivated because it's fucking. This game's not activated here. There's nothing in between for a breather, obviously. So I'll give some thoughts at the end of Silent Hill 2. Uh, well, I had Judas in my mind. Okay, this is kind of really creepy because that child was definitely in a fucking. Okay, but that interracial couple's pretty big in there. Who was the big three? We both know the answer to that question. Nothing. Just... You are the frog in a pot, boiling, 
It feels like it's meant to be something like Bioshock, obviously. But it feels like it's supposed to be something like more akin to like Bioshock 1. Which is admittedly a good game. You know, it's very dark and foreboding while being somehow also, you know, big and also somehow cramped and small. I'm wondering if this is going to be something similar, but in space and not the ocean. Like, what does the Ayn Rand in space instead of Ayn Rand the diver? If that makes sense. Did you see a lot of, like, mannequin robots taking over people, like, like a, like a replicant to play them? I'm wondering that's what they're gonna do with this here. Wait, what I broke? I didn't break shit, ma'am. Nah, 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 nah. Don't be a white woman and blame me for shit. I ain't done shit yet. Something I like about... About Sony's data play, there's a lot to go into. Stare into the flame. I am. Think of this fire as a beacon. What is this? Wait. It's warmth. I know we're in the VR. Energy. We're probably in the VR section now, I'm guessing. No. Because we didn't see. Focus. Let me talk about gameplay. Which means it's VR. On your wife. Oh, wait. I know that name. Is this fucking Metro? Into. The void. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's Metro. I, well, Metro's a game I want to keep saying I'm going to get into and I never do. I think I read the first novel way back when on some translated website I stole it from, probably. I don't think Dimitri cares about that, honestly. But this looks kind of unique. He looks like this for a VR game. But I think it would be cool if we are Oh, that's fucking terrifying. Jesus. I was gonna say, I think it would be new for a VR game. It's an old school, like, first person, like, sort of sorcery RPG. Like, those old DOS RPGs, but, like, in VR, modern graphics. Like, the first, like, like the first Elder Scrolls game. That would be kind of cool. I don't think we'd ever get it. I thought it was gonna be James Bond. Oh! Okay, well, I think I just got my wish, shit. This is just an old school RPG with, with modern graphics and on combat. Okay, you sold me already. I don't have a VR, I'm not fucking getting it. But if I did, this would definitely be it. Like, I was just talking about during the Dementia thing about how, like, an old school sorcery RPG game would be kind of sick, and I got my fucking wish. But you can't tell me an old school sort of sorcery RPG like this? Bottom graphics and like dagger fall or like like the, the stingy and abyss, which is Ultima. I know. Hear me out. But that one, I'm fucking a rock. Like you can't tell me what it. Also, we need an Ultima game. Do they? Do they? Be the motherfucker with the motherfucker's head. I love to go off this fucking trailer and I'm kind of for it. It doesn't do anything. That's Mjolnir. Okay, um. Okay, Legendary Tales. You sold me. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. Like, that wouldn't just fucking rock your socks like that. I knew you would come. I was Wait. One. Dragon's Dogma? I make no mistake. I am the Dragon's Dogma. The dragon will appear before you when the time is I, come. I, for one, never played a Dragon's Dogma. That being said, Charles Martinet as a dragon is actually kind of cool. It, 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 it was it's Dogma, right? Yo, this is Monster Hunter now. This is really just just Monster Hunter with Double Way Christ Combat. This is something you can fucking. Fucking Monster Hunter. Monster, watch out! But that was just a yeah, that's just fucking the same Oops. Like, that was a hell of a order. You truly are formidable, Arisen. But I wouldn't mind being able to shoot off a fucking boss and hit and shoot him with a fucking arrow or gun. That should be in Double Cry 6. But like, 
So the combat as you see in this game is probably in Devil May Cry now, or in Monster Hunter. Make manifest. I think that's actually going to be cool. That's the last of this world. I wouldn't right. mind seeing Hold stuff like this to your strength of will, Arisen One. Those who can be of aid Dark? to you will reveal Capcom themselves has those in time. Cool repertoire of Thy will, the verse of it. thy soul. I do have the These are all the means you have to carve right thy path anew. You have Resident Evil Remake. And then every now and then you get a dragon's dog, or you get like a fucking beautiful yes, drill. Yes, your wicked schemes will avail you and not. And we more of this cool want. shit every now and then. Just the anime never happened though. Hey, everyone, hello, Team Ninja, Team Ninja no Yasuda. え、ライズオブザローニンは自由な探索や幅広い戦闘を体験できるオープンワールドアクションRPGです。歴史上の人物たちの人間によって物語が変化していきますので、ぜひ一人のローニンとして皆様それぞれの幕末を体験してください。オ
you guys have shown so much. More VR? What did you do? Just messing around, man. It wasn't serious. I'm such an idiot. Is this Saw? There are a you guys few remember the fucking to make Konami sure fucking made understand. Saw games? Because those games were fucking wild. In fact, they stopped making the Saw games. It's it a tragedy to man Past fucking is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. Like, you can't tell me those two games didn't fucking slap. Because they fucking slap hard. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I wonder what it's gonna be. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this. Because it looks like Saw. Oh, maybe actually it's Saw, sure. I wanna play a game. I can't play games. I have a PS3. Those fucking. Looking for me. Okay, you know what? I've never played until dawn until now, until recently, potentially. I I keep saying that because I have the game, but I just never played it. But that being said, <laughs> I'm interested. Being interested. What the fuck is this? Like, what the fuck is this? So, is he an octopus man? Was he raped by an octopus? Maybe. We don't know. But I'm interested. So, I got to know. I got to know what the fuck this is. Okay, what is with her mask? Wait. What is with her mask? It's just surgical gloves as a mask? What? The mask I make when I return, I have a mask on and my fucking larps. What is this? Hmm. Is it because she's supposed to be silent? What? Oh. I'm not not interested because I am interested. I just want to know what the fuck this is. Uh, that explains a lot. Fucking Kojima. Wait. Baby. That's Shining 2? What the fuck though? Why? Why why the fucking baby? What the fuck? Why? Welcome to Drawbridge, Sam. Genius Conjumbo. Why? A mobile base of operations. Come on, I'll help you get your bearings. No, 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 no. This is the ship's arm. Why did he do that? Here you can check your weapons and put them through their paces. Like, why did that just... These rooms over here belong to other members of the crew. I need to know why the, same the baby yours. had a fucking like, ship in it. And the shower's down at the end. This is one hell of a ship you got here. Courtesy of the UCA, I'm guessing. No. As I told oh, you, hey, the bridge is a civilian the outfit. Glove mask shit. But we do have a generous patron with access to plenty of capital and tech. Sounds like a UCA big shot. Don't ask me. I'm asking you now. We've never met face to face. I'm going to ask you now because you said not to they ask me. They value their privacy. Seriously? No better than to believe that bullshit. I'm glad Norman Reedus it's is the same here. Deal as America. Sans funky fetus. The people here are all oh. spread out. Cut off from one another. I, I want to know. want you to help us bring the world together. What I want to know. <clears throat> Sam, would you mind if I join you? Why? Humor him. Hmm. His knowledge and experience will probably come in handy down the road. Yes. Really, Sam? Your buttocks. This. What about you? Why shotgun? is he. I just realized. I prefer the, the puppet seat. is moving like a fucking. Hmm. Do you read me? You'll first need to access the Mexico side plate so, terminal. After we've confirmed the coverage, we can take the DHV Magellan and 
when Miles was moving. The problem is not everybody Peter, wants to be part of the UCA. Miles was moving that's not the plan, sir. Or differently? The UCA isn't looking to expand its and borders. And that's what it looks like. Just, Just like with that. Mexico, they want to bring new regions into the network. And I was wondering, anyway, wondering the why... the DHU Magellan's here to back you up. I was wondering, you always want to know why he was As always, that. you'll be the one leading the way to expand the network. What's your role in all this? Because it was weird that You're he was the commander. doing that. That's right. These days, I'm fragile in name only. Which, in, I guess, now makes more sense in hindsight, obviously, but like... You brought America together. Did you, though? Helped it be reborn as the UCA. But I'm afraid the death stranding is far ah, from over. Ah, the death stranding, name type drop. Humanity so is still in danger. Like streaming? Still on the brink of extinction. Don't act like you don't see it. A lot of things changed after you went off on your own. Especially within the UCA. Bridge is no longer overseas the distribution network. Does, does they withdrew once Fair things enough. were up and running. That's true. I'm, so your friends and co-workers all went their separate ways. so fucking long. Within network coverage, like, there's no need to rely on the in the fucking visual novel. So, being able to be so after I closed up shop, I went and started a new group. One that handles working but regions game, outside Death the UCA. this was fun. We decided to call ourselves Drawbridge. Ah, if the bridge is one. With the support of the Chiral Network and APAS, humanity will I be love. free from the need to move around. What the fuck is that Transformer's name? Bots are capable of handling the Transformer who's... He's alive. His, uh, Soundwave. I love Soundwave. He called himself a ghost, but... He found a way back from the beach ghost now. just so he could kill us. But Jida. He said he came back to get revenge Jida, on you and me. Jida, Jida, Jida. He's afraid of no ghosts. <laughs> hey, Brian. Did you miss me? Yeah, I figured you'd pay this place a visit. Is that Soon the crow? Distributing the fruits. Of Are we gonna be shooting him with blanks? <laughs> Guns Christ. and violence, the whole damn world could be yours. <laughs> Same as it ever was. But well, he looks like. Looks like you decided to trade in that thing. rope for a stick this go round. Well, I suppose it looks even like Porter the fucking to pull the singer from time. fucking Van ha Eddie Van Halen as the crow. Oh, what about you? Don't suck his dick. Hey, oh. buddy. Are you just another soulless uh, little husk, uh, huh? Let go of me. Do not touch. Oh. Do not Pathetic want. Pathetic guitarist. Where's the rest of your band? No, uh, 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 uh. Baby. Well, ain't that something? I'm an uncle. Was it you, Heads? Huh? Was it you that killed Lou? No, I killed Og. I still don't know, do you? Where nobody goes. Huh? Fuck! Huh? Uh, I was joking about him being a fucking Vanny Halen, but he's gonna fucking start fucking doing a rip and shit. He might as well be fucking Van Halen. Cause that's just Van Halen, bro. Is he gonna also pick Dr. Feelgood at some point and he's going alright? Dr. Feelgood! Feel alright. Something he said. You don't know a goddamn thing about Lou. All right, but what so do I know about Og? Let's see what That's we can question. find on Lou. He's on the island when nobody goes. If you want answers, you're gonna have to find them yourself. But will I though? The ones you do find, well, that pain you nurse, will only get worse. Sam, the man in the dark about everything. Am I in the dark, though? Don't forget, coming on this expedition was meant to help you find the strength to carry on. And you have. Oh. We all so know you've got this. So it's on the beach. Now it's time to finish the, the journey, beach Sam. Death Stranding 1 that no one can talk about. Please understand, Sam. I'm interested to see where this is going to go. 
We never meant to string you along. Ah, string along. The string. Let me go, Jimbo. I love Kojima games. It was games. filled with a fluid that contained amino acids. I had every Metal Gear Solid One's game. identical in structure to the kind series. found in Tar. I have... I'm sorry. Zone of there the Enders are amino acids in Tar? I in have a copy of Snatcher. Of course. How else did you think that chiral creatures could so emerge I'm from So I'm going to say this as a, somebody with those in Some mind. Some have even theorized that the Tar is a sort of primordial soup. what the soup. fuck is up with Kojima games? I was there. I saw her being, all. Like... It was a hellhole. Weirdly anime, maybe? Like, you see, after you left Bridges, I decided to do a little digging. Now, according to them, BB-28 was flagged for disposal and subsequently incinerated four years ago. Do not long touch Long before BB. you and Lou first met. Do not, do not insinuate things about BB. Do we not... We stand, we stand BB in this house. That's creepy. And not in a cool, creepy way either, in a weird way. And now here way. with me today is visionary game creator and founder of Kojima Productions, Isn't Kojima this his 40th anniversary? Oh, hey. Welcome. Today, like he's been, I'm he's been excited to announce that together, as part of the PlayStation and Kojima Productions partnership, Hideo is going to take us on an exciting new adventure. One that I've been encouraging him to reinvent for years. え、新世代の。え、え、さらに2年後には僕のゲーム制作人生の40周年を迎えます。A new action espionage game by Hideo Kojima. This is one of my favorite genres, one that I've been hoping you would revisit with a bold new vision. Can you share anything else about this new development? So he's going back to the actions. <laughs> We're all really excited about this project, and we will fully support you with the latest innovation Sony has to offer. More details to come. Hopefully, serpent guys. Stay tuned. Me? Me? So earlier, I talked about how Silent Hill 2 looked interesting, but I'm keep with this big butt here. If you don't mind. Um, okay, Before we more? go, I have one final announcement. What is it? State of Play will return February 6th with an extensive look at Final okay. Fantasy VII Rebirth. Square Enix I... will be sharing new gameplay details along with exciting news you won't want to miss. We hope you enjoyed the show. See you soon. So I'm going to start off by saying that... PlayStation. Oh shoot, my hair's out weirdly. Nobody said anything. Shit. They guys love me. Shit. They don't love me. They don't even know who they don't even know my name. So earlier I was spurging out about Silent Hill. I am so gonna spurg out about Silent Hill a little bit. Um when it comes to survival horror games, you don't want your survival horror protagonists to use a lot of force. You would have force, like, like, like fucking, what's the fuck's name? Um, Resident Evil, my fucking favorite franchise, I forgot its name. Resident Evil, you can do the bang, bang, shoot, shoot all you want. It doesn't make it good for doing that. Could you have a game with survival horror protagonists shooting people? Yes. Could you use excessive force? Yes. But does excessive force make your survival horror game good? 
He could. I mean, if, you know, again, Resident Evil 4 had anything to say about it, didn't. That's the fucking whole thing for it. Um, that being said, however, it's not like... You know, it's not like we're going to go ahead and say that you know, we're making the next fucking Shakespeare, clearly. That being said, however, you know, things like Silent Hill, however, you can go in and play Silent Hill 1. My Again, my Let's Play Silent Hill 1 proved you can do that. That being said, however, anything past 2, you don't have, you're not, they don't. How do I put this here? It's not meant to be played like that. It's meant to be an ethereal experience. You can shoot Pyramid Head, and you can get the ending where you shoot Pyramid Head. But that's only one way around, and the preferred, sorry, and the preferred way they want you to go about it is to be more strategical and that gameplay footage just showed shooting and and QTE not to get raped as a victim I can say it it's not bad it's just not great either it's something to look at and I'm gonna say that maybe it'll be good maybe in a vortex of games, Silent Hill 2 may be a fantastic game. It might be, it might look better once we actually see the gameplay. And I'm hoping that's the case. Because Silent Hill 2 is a game that's, I mean, I prefer 3 over 2. But Silent Hill 2. 2 is the game that everybody loves for a reason. It's Silent Hill fucking do. And if you're going out of your way to make Silent Hill 2 that, then you don't know what you've, you've made. Because there's no way Silent Hill 2 has ever been that, you know? And I really, really, really do hope that the people at Konami understand that, you know, what they're doing. I'm sure they know what they're doing. I'm not going to sit here and say the game devs don't know what they're doing. Because clearly they do. But I just hope that the game devs are seeing things people are saying about the game and going, Hey, maybe we should cut back on the excess of gun use. And I'm just some fucking retard on 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 fucking YouTube. You know, maybe who knows? You know, maybe somebody at like Bluebird team understands what Silent Hill Two did right, and doesn't just make it a bang bang shoot shoot up chuck the boogie. And I'm sure they will. You know, I'm I am excited, and I am content knowing that Silent Hill Two. Possibly it's going to have a lot more than bang, bang, shoot, shoot, cool action scene, blame a, written, blame a fucking victim. And I want to end on a positive note. Silent Hill 2 is a good game. This remake looks a little bit like Resident Evil 4, but I'm hoping it's just, I'm hoping it's just a means of talking, get people to talk about it. And when February rolls around, we get a more down-to-earth trailer. And that's my hope for this next game of State of Play. That we get a more down-to-earth trailer. We don't get big action set piece. Uh, James Sutherland dies the end. I'm hoping that it's done down-to-earth. Like Silent Hill 2 was. And that's my prediction for this remake. That it's down-to-earth. With that being said, however, the other games looked... Decent to pretty great. Games like... Games like fucking... What the fuck is it called now? Phone Party looks okay. Uh, Stellar Blade looks 
pretty decent. I have them all written down in my head. I just forgot here. V Rising is great. I, I, I simmed over V Rising. I'm hoping that when time comes, these games are fantastic. And that gamers get the games that they deserve rather than games that they're just made to sell. And with that note, guys, thanks for hanging out. I'm Nexa Giga. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day today, guys. You guys stay safe. Enjoy your rest of your day today. Love yourself and all that. Peace.